So baking soda, is it good? Is it bad? Should you keep taking it for acid reflux? A lot of people are taking this thinking it's good for them and they don't really understand what they're doing. Baking soda is sodium bicarbonate. Now take a look at this. We got the stomach right here. The stomach normally should be not just slightly acid, extremely acid between one and three. That's normal. You need your stomach acids to be at that pH to digest proteins, to kill off microbes, and to absorb minerals. Okay. Now, as this food gets through the stomach, it goes into the small intestine right here, and the pancreas releases a bicarbonate. Now, remember what baking soda is. It's sodium bicarbonate. Okay. So our bodies are supposed to have bicarbonates not in the stomach, but just past the stomach in the small intestine to neutralize the acid so it doesn't damage the small intestine. And also the bile that comes out of the gallbladder, that's also alkaline to help neutralize this. So bicarbonates are, are alkaline. So what we're trying to do is we're trying to neutralize that acid. But if you're putting this baking soda, this sodium bicarbonate at this level in the stomach, you are going to mess up your digestion down the road. Now you're going to feel better temporarily because of the acid reflux. It's going to help neutralize it. But the next time you eat, it's going to be a little bit weaker and weaker and weaker and weaker because you're treating the symptom. You're not treating the cause of the problem. The question is, why is the stomach more acid? Why are you getting acid reflux in the first place? Normally what happens is the valve on top of the stomach is not shutting. So that acid is refluxing back up into the esophagus. It's also called GERD. And so why is that? It could be from either an autonomic nervous system problem because you're deficient in B1, or it could be you don't have enough stomach acid because that valve closes if you have enough stomach acid. And this is why people feel so much better when they start taking apple cider vinegar for problems like this, or they take betaine hydrochloride, which is an acidifier, and they can build up their hydrochloric acid, they feel so much better, and it's more corrective. Sometimes you might take three, but in reality, you may need five, six, seven, eight, even up to 10 before a meal initially for it to work. Just from experience working with a lot of people over many years, I found that some people just need more, and then it works like a charm. And the problem is they don't know that, so they try it for a couple days. They take a couple, doesn't do anything, and then they give up. The key with that is taking more. There's some other things you can do as well, like the combination of zinc carnosine and betaine hydrochloride is very effective for acid reflux. Some of the long-term side effects that can occur if you're taking too much sodium bicarbonate over a period of time, vomiting, diarrhea, kidney damage, depressed breathing because your pH is altered, worsened cardiac heart failure. So if you already have pre-existing heart problems and you're taking baking soda that throws off the pH, it messes up the, um, the heart. Okay, and then we have cerebral hemorrhage, bleeding, and then we have a deficiency of calcium, which causes muscle spasms. And then we have a decrease in potassium, which leads to a whole cascade of bad things that can happen after that. You can get belching, bloating, but other than that, you're good. Hey, before you go real quick, I have a course entitled How to Bulletproof Your Immune System. It's a free course. I want you to take it. And here's why. Here's you. Here is your environment. Everyone is focused on this over here, avoiding your environment. But what about here? What about strengthening your immune system? That's what's missing. This course will show you how to bulletproof yourself. And so you can tolerate and resist your environment much better by strengthening your own immune system. I put a link down in the description right down below. Check it out and get signed up today.